The Western University in Ontario has some impressive numbers to boast about. It has 12 faculties, offers 400 specialties, and receives over $200 million in external research funding annually. Notably, the university is a leader in climate research and is home to the world's first hexagonal wind tunnel. This wind tunnel, housed in a separate building with two domes, 40 and 25 meters in diameter, features 106 adjustable fans that can simulate hurricanes and tornadoes. Such tests aid in finding optimal solutions for manufacturing wind turbines and enhancing cities' resilience against harsh weather. This is particularly relevant for the United States, where Hurricane Harvey alone caused $125 billion in damages to Texas. What's interesting about Gothenburg? Well, it's the second most populated city in Sweden. In 1985, it hosted the Eurovision Song Contest, and recently, it has implemented these charging stations for vehicles. Let's talk about them, especially since they were commissioned by a taxi company, which means there are both environmental and financial benefits. The numbers back it up. This charging method extends battery life by up to eight times. On top of that, with a power transmission of up to 450 kilowatts, these stations can charge your vehicle by 10 or 20 percent while you buy your coffee or go to the restroom. Mud, rain, and snow don't affect the system. The technology is patented, and it comes with real-time cloud analytics. The noise from passenger trains can reach 80 or even 90 decibels, and subways can be even louder. Numbers don't tell us much, but city noise has become a global concern with the issue raised at the UN. In Europe alone, noise contributes to approximately 50,000 cases of coronary heart disease annually, a problem that demands attention. Luckily, there's a solution. These train tracks with sleepers and dampers that adjust to particular conditions, reducing noise levels by 20 decibels. Interestingly, implementing these upgraded tracks turns out to be 30% cheaper than conventional tracks, as they require less concrete. Eurostar passengers have already experienced their effectiveness on the route London to Paris. Humanity has come up with all kinds of strange events, such as the Lightweight Award that honors the lightest designs. In the health category, this year's winner is a remarkable protection device, ideal for volleyball or basketball players. It works a bit like car seat belts. A flexible insert is wrapped around the ankle, and a hydraulic mini piston secures it firmly to avoid injuries. This patented piston activates in milliseconds and lasts for at least 4 million steps. For the best results, the user should wear the bandage over the socks. The device is available in five sizes and weighs just 305 grams. Embracing this cutting-edge sports technology will cost you $334 for the set. This drone has caught the attention of the US military, particularly the United States Navy. What makes it so remarkable? It can vertically land and take off. It's compact and weighs only 57 kilograms in one version, including fuel and payload. The estimated flight time is eight hours on the main fuel, with an additional hour on reserve fuel. A two-person team is enough to operate the UAV. This vehicle can handle speeds of more than 90 km per hour, and operates effectively in extreme temperature ranging from 50 to minus 40 degrees Celsius. Its modular design allows for the installation of various equipment, such as electromagnetic warfare and radar systems. 
But the manufacturers didn't stop there. They're currently working on modifying the UAV for a hybrid heavy fuel engine, as the gasoline engine didn't meet the Marines' requirements. The creators of this device claim that it's the most revolutionary innovation to drinking water since the tap. And they're tackling a significant problem. Back in 2018, 3.6 billion people struggled to access clean water. Now the question is whether these people can afford buying this device for $500. But for that money, they'll get up to 9.5 litres of purified drinking water every day, directly extracted from the air. This innovative device operates on the principle of condensation, simply powered by a standard outlet, and occupies about as much space as a microwave. It offers carbon and silver nanoparticle filtration, along with magnesium remineralization, ensuring not just clean, but also tasty water. If a machine uprising ever happens, green technology might play a role. Scientists are already working on cyborg plants, like a Venus flytrap that can be controlled by electrodes from a computer. But that's not all. Now we can grow wires inside plants, allowing us to connect sensors to our favorite flowers. For instance, one of your flowers could send you a text message if it detects your cat's chewing on its leaves. This technology could have military applications too, with bushes on bases monitoring people's movements. The world is moving closer to technologies once only found in science fiction, but instead of cyberpunk, we seem to be heading towards biopunk. Here is an interesting development for both humans and robots, an additional arm powered by compressed air. The concept is pretty simple. Built-in pumps in the shoes supply air to special reservoirs, and then the air flows into the arm as needed. During tests, the new limb successfully lifted 4.5 kilograms. All the components are machine washable and have a reasonable price of $20. On another note, here's a glove that can turn adults into children, allowing them to experience what it's like to interact with the world with hands the size of a child's. It provides tactile feedback and costs just a few dollars, as the parts are all 3D printed. This glove is beneficial not only for researchers, but also for toy manufacturers, allowing them to understand how comfortable their products will be for children to hold. This is a robotic mirror that redirects sunlight indoors. It's available for $500, and delivery will begin in September. Along with the mirror, buyers will receive a dose of serotonin, dopamine, and vitamin D, all thanks to the sunlight. All of this will enhance their mood, boost productivity, and improve sleep, according to the manufacturers. The mirror is solar-powered, tracks the sun itself, and weighs about 3 kilograms, making it lightweight and easy to install. It provides ample lighting for a 46-square-meter area, and under ideal conditions, it generates the equivalent to a 100-watt light bulb. Additionally, the company has plans to incorporate a USB Type-C port and wall mounts. Is an exciting offer for people with an extra one and a half million dollars, a personal submarine. This two-seater combines a hypercar and an airplane, allowing you to dive up to 100 meters and stay underwater for up to eight hours. 
It runs on electricity and has a modest speed of up to 9 km per hour. Safety-wise, it's well equipped with emergency systems that can last for 72 hours. There are two independent oxygen systems and an emergency surfacing option. The submarine was designed by British naval engineer Graham Hawkes, who also created the submarine for the James Bond film For Your Eyes Only. Looking for a cheaper option? Check out this diving scooter, available for $1,700. It's lightweight, weighing less than 4 kilograms together with the battery, and can work for 100 minutes at a depth of 50 meters, allowing you to capture cool videos as it's equipped with GoPro mounts. The motor packs 600 watts of power, and you can even combine two scooters into one. With two speed settings, it can reach a maximum of 6.4 km per hour. The body is easy to grip with one or two hands, and the controls are so simple that it's suitable for users aged 16 and above. Are you tired of the Formula One and NASCAR? Well, Australian team Alauda Aeronautics has an exciting alternative for you – flying car racing. They've already taken a step towards this futuristic sport with a race between two unmanned Mark III cars in 2021, reaching speeds of up to 200 km per hour. Their next goal is to organize fully-fledged races with four teams, each consisting of two pilots. Finding suitable pilots is a challenge due to the weight capacity of 80 kilograms. However, with the involvement of experts from McLaren, Boeing, Rolls-Royce and other industry giants, they aim to achieve F1-level maneuverability and have different battery packs for different races, akin to the tyre combinations in traditional races specially adjusted to adapt to different tracks. Wave energy is a promising field, with the potential to generate over 15 kilowatts per meter of wave crest. Test results of such generators are always intriguing, especially when it comes to the numbers. In a span of five months, a 20-meter machine consistently produced 5 kilowatts of power, even in wave conditions up to 2.3 meters high. These successful tests took place in Scotland's Orkney Islands, explaining why the government invested over $51 million in support of marine energy. This investment holds great value, especially for the future. Just 1% of the total wave energy could power over 50 million homes, highlighting the immense potential of this renewable energy source. Once you install the engine we've just shown you, you simply need to capture your model's stunts and your friend's faces of disbelief. For amateur filming, consider this mini drone that takes off from your hand, follows you, orbits around you, and reaches heights of up to 15 meters. It comes with stabilization and vibration protection, offering a maximum shooting resolution of 2.7K at 30fps or 1080p at 60fps. This drone has a battery life of about 10 minutes and is as light as two small popsicles at just 125 grams. You can get a set with two batteries and a case for $330. The team has already raised over a million dollars through Indiegogo. While some debate the success of the F-35 fighter jet, NASA quietly continues working on the lesser-known X-59 project. The goal is to achieve quiet supersonic capabilities by reducing shockwave and airplane noise. 
The program is aptly named Quiet Supersonic Technology, and construction of the experimental model began in 2018, with its first flight possibly happening this year. The 4-meter engine with a thrust of around 10 tons is the key focal point. If successful, it's expected to produce a muffled pop instead of the typical sonic boom associated with supersonic flight. This advancement could usher in interesting times for aviation, since noise has been the primary reason why many countries' regulators prohibit civilian flights of supersonic airplanes. Attention Model Builders this engine is perfect for bringing your creations to life. It weighs just 415 grams, boasts a volume of 2.5 cc, and can rev up to 16,500 rpm. It's suitable for both cars and airplanes. Notably, it features a reinforced crankshaft and rouleau triangles, which you may recognize from our previous videos. Moreover, this engine stands out for its low vibration level and minimal parts, making adjustments easier. You can find this gem on sale for around $500. Imagine active noise reduction with nearly 100% efficiency, achieved using a layer of plasma. It might sound like science fiction, but this technology is now licensed as a commercial product, and it will soon hit the shelves. The efficiency is astonishing. While a conventional sound-absorbing material needs a 4-meter thick layer to completely silence a 20 Hz frequency wave, this development from a Swiss company only requires 17 millimeters. Operating on the same principle as its counterparts, this innovation generates sound waves in counterphase. However, instead of a regular membrane, it uses ionization to create a thin plasma layer in the air. This not only saves space and energy, but also offers promising applications in various settings, from concert halls to airplanes. In India, a team of volunteers managed to remove a staggering 13,000 tons of trash from a beach in 104 weeks. Luckily, it's not that bad everywhere, and sometimes the cleanup process is simpler. This machine clears strips about a meter wide and up to 12 centimeters deep, effortlessly picking up debris, branches, and rocks. The almost 10 horsepower gasoline engine offers infinitely variable speed control and replaceable filter nets, allowing you to clean about 4,200 square meters in just an hour. On some websites, this machine is sold for $10,000.